Have you ever wondered how storks manage to travel thousands of miles? These elegant creatures engage in a fascinating behavior known as migration. Migration in essence is a seasonal journey undertaken by many animal species. And for our feathered friends, the storks, it's a long distance flight stretching all the way from the cozy nests of Europe to the warm heartlands of Africa. Now you might be thinking, why such a strenuous journey? Well, it's all about survival. As the icy winter sets in Europe, food becomes scarce. So, storks choose to embark on this challenging journey in search of warmer climates and abundant food resources. Covering such a vast distance is no mean feat. It requires exceptional endurance, a keen sense of direction, and an intricate understanding of weather patterns. The journey is far from easy, but these majestic birds have developed a unique set of skills to complete their incredible migration. So, how do storks prepare for such a long journey? You might wonder, well, it's a fascinating process. Storks have a special pre-migration routine that involves a lot of feeding. In the weeks leading up to their departure, they gorge themselves on frogs, insects, fish, and other small prey. This feeding frenzy is essential for them to build up energy reserves that will sustain them during their arduous journey. But food isn't the only thing storks need to get ready. They also band together in large flocks. These formations are a spectacle to behold, with hundreds, sometimes even thousands of storks gathering together. The reason behind this is safety in numbers, as well as the aerodynamic advantage of flying in a group. The timing of their departure is also crucial. Storks are excellent weather forecasters, and they wait for just the right conditions before setting off on their epic journey. With their bodies ready and their flocks formed, storks are prepared for the long journey ahead. The journey is long and fraught with dangers. So how do storks make it across? Well, let's start with the route. These amazing birds trace a path that spans thousands of miles, from the chilly reaches of Siberia to the warmer climes of Africa. As they venture, they soar at altitudes of up to 5,000 feet, harnessing the power of thermal updrafts to conserve energy. These natural elevators of warm air give them a boost, allowing them to glide effortlessly for long distances. But it's not all smooth sailing. The storks face their fair share of challenges. They battle adverse weather conditions, from strong winds to sudden storms. And let's not forget the predators. Eagles, hawks, and other raptors are a constant threat. Yet these birds maintain a steady speed of around 50 miles per hour, navigating these hazards with remarkable skill. Despite these challenges, storks manage to complete their journey, demonstrating their incredible tenacity and resilience. After their long journey, how do storks acclimate to their new environment? Here's where the marvel of nature truly unfolds. Having traveled thousands of miles, these storks finally reach their destination. Their arrival is not the end, but a new beginning, a testament to their tenacity and resilience. As they touch down, their focus swiftly shifts to adapting to the new environment. They begin to explore seeking out food sources, a critical task as they replenish their energy reserves depleted from the long flight. Their diet, primarily consisting of insects, fish and small mammals, is abundant in these new surroundings ensuring their survival. Next, they start the process of nesting. Using twigs and other available materials, they construct their homes, often in tall trees or on rooftops. These sites are crucial for stork populations, providing a safe haven for breeding and raising their young. Stork's migration is a testament to their remarkable adaptability and strength, a phenomenon that continues to fascinate us.